welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. For those of you that don't know me, my name is Alicia and I'm a full-time reseller. Um, I primarily sell clothing. I've tried to dabble in other things and I've just never worked out. But I do have a thread up unboxing for you guys. Um, I'm not entirely sure what this is. I went back onto the thread up website to see what I ordered and it doesn't, it really doesn't tell you. So I do know it was a denim box. I don't know if it was like 50 pounds or 50 pairs or what exactly it was. Um, but as we dig in, we'll see. There are two boxes oops, that are this size and they're pretty heavy. So um, I did pay a total of $69 and 62 cents. Um, yeah, so let's just dig right in. And yes, I know I'm in my kitchen, very odd spot. This is just where they, everyone's home, you know, and right now this is just what's going to work best. My kitchen. <laughs> so let's see. As I'm destroying the box. Joe's. I've heard good things about this brand, I think. So Joe's jeans. Is that what it would be? Here's the backs. There's like a little, their little, must be their logo or something. But here is the tag right there. And size, their fit is honey. Um, that must be their style. And then they're a size 27. Oops. Oh, I apparently get kids clothes too. <laughs> so here's a 12 to 18 month old navy little girls jeans. And they are lined with fleece. Um, these are really nice. I know we use, my fiance wears a lot of jeans like these uh, for work and for hunting and just in the winter. Um, so maybe these will go well with the winter coming up um they don't go for much though oh and you get shorts too nice these are well they're almost famous is the brand size five pair of white shorts these are nice um they might actually fit me i have a pair of the diva Old Navy brand. If you hear a lot of noises, we have, so there's kids watching TV everywhere, and we have a lot of construction going on outside of our house. Wow, this is like, look at the zipper. Can you see? No, you can't, but it's like destroyed. Um, so these are Old Navy, and they're a size 2 regular. They look really big, though. So... And then Forever Denim, Rue 21, or sorry, Forever 21, distressing on them. These are cute. I like that acid wash. These are size 27 also. Wow, these are like all my sizes. Lucky me. <laughs> Miss, I don't know, actually. <laughs> I can't even try. There it is. And this is a size, it looks like the size tags cut off, I'll have to measure, um, just some gray skinny jeans with some raw hem on the bottom here, and there's like a little cut out there on both sides. Levi's 527, they're 33 by 34. I 
I have Banana Republic. These look very outdated, but here they are. I don't know why I ordered the, this jeans bot actually, because I ordered 50 pairs, or not 50, yeah. So this is size four. Um, I remember from liquidation.com a while back, actually, I ordered, was it like, it was like 50 pairs of jeans on liquidation.com and it was a terrible buy, but so I have all those jeans, a lot of them still. And no, I just ordered 50 pounds more. Um, okay. So this is, you want to, you want to, or want to bet a butt? <laughs> Why am I mid-rise skinny jeans? Uh, these actually, I know they sell these, or I don't know where they typically sell them, but I, the shorts I'm wearing right now, actually, they're black shorts. They're the Why Am I brand. I got them from either Ross or TJ, probably Ross. I do like Ross better. So yeah, there's these. Um, they are a size five. Again, with my size, why? You don't want to keep everything. Yep, so these look like men's, and this is, so there's, they say size 34, 32. Um, wow, let's see. Wait until I show you guys the front. So these are bulwark, maybe I'm, oh, oh my god, okay, so here's the front. Very, very distressed. I'm gonna have to give these to my fiance for work. Maybe they'll fit him. Um, it's got like, you know, you know, t you know, chew, tobacco chew. That is like the indent of someone having chew. <laughs> so whoever owned these was a chewer. Um, these are flame resistant. I don't know. They have like a little thing on the side there. I don't know what that's all about. <clears throat> okay. Oh, so it's not just jeans. It's just denim in general, general, I guess. So here's a styling co denim jacket. Um, I wonder if this is like a DIY jacket. Um, yeah, I can smell the bleach actually. There it is. It's kind of cool. I mean, there's a lot of like, I feel like they didn't do it that well, but like the back is like a whole white. Um, and then I noticed somewhere, where did I see that? There's a lot of like distressing, which I'm gonna guess isn't supposed to be there. And oh yeah, like here's a cut in the, so I may, I might not actually sell this. And yeah, it's some more right there. Oh, and really bad right there. Um, yeah, I might just have to toss that because I don't think that that is supposed to be there. Okay, next pair of jeans we have salvage denim. Or no. Yeah, salvage? I don't know. Here. Ooh, they look really thinned out in the back here. Here they are. Distressing on the knees and they do have a raw hem. Here is, oh, this is kind of cute. Little sleeveless denim vest, Aeropostale, a size small. Oh, my hands in the way. A size small. The back's got like that crochet detailing. It's got some distressing. This is cute. Made well. That's awesome. Yeah, nice. Okay, so these are made well. They look like they're in good shape. A nine inch high rise skinny size 28 okay nice yeah I think these are in good condition there is a raw hem yeah to me they look good new frontier don't think I've ever heard of that um just a wet pair of white pants Keep having to move the spots over. <laughs> okay, this is American Eagle. 
a distressed pair of black skinny jeans. Let's see, they are a size 28 by 32. You can see the distressing on there. American Eagle, that's always a good flip or fast flip usually. I don't know about black. Um, the butt looks pretty worn. Wow, it does in the camera. It doesn't look that bad right here. But let me tell you, that light, <laughs> I got a new light and wow, does it work or what? Okay, we've got some express jeans. These look very worn. Very stretchy, it feels like. They're leggings, Maya mid-rise, size four, regular. Legging, I would say more jegging, they're not leggings. Um, okay, page, okay. Oh, look, darn it. There is a lot of dimpling though in the crotch area, crotch region. But there is the brand. There they are, and otherwise they're in good condition. They're a skinny jean, they look like, right? Yes, peg skinny. I don't know, that white is really bright on my eyes, though, I have to say. Okay, these are highway jeans. Never heard of that. I'll show you guys the tag. Um, and I'm going to guess they're capris. S uh, size 7. Um, they're really short, so yeah, I'm guessing they're capri capris. Um, and they've got like the raw hem. Okay, this is Levi Strauss, 721 high rise skinny, size 29, a lot of dimpling in the crotch area though. Black skinny jeans. A pair of three months boys pants. Gap Denim. These look like they're in good condition. And Gap is a good brand. I've never sold their jeans, but yeah. These are just a 28 regular favorite legging. Does it say legging or jegging? Favorite jegging, sorry. Another Levi's. The thing's all ripped out in the back. Like, why do people do stuff like that? I don't understand it. Maybe they just wore out, I don't know. But anyways, here they are. I'm gonna have to measure them. I don't see a size. They look like they're just like boot cut. Yeah, I don't see a size. No. Cause I think the size was on the back here. So I'm not really liking this box. I gotta say, another pair of American Eagle. These are a size four. Uh, jeggings. Aeropostale Chelsea skinny boot. Um, these look very updated also. There's the butt. Ooh, these look really outdated. <laughs> Angels, yeah, I think that's like a really old brand. These I'm not even gonna bother trying to resell. I think I have a pair kind of like that listed that I got from my um, liquidation.com box and I think I still have them. Okay, this is Amber, Com Amber Crombie and Fitch. Um, I would say awesome except for, not awesome, but like cool, except for there's a lot of dimpling in the crotch again, which is obviously why they're not going to sell them. They're going to send them out in boxes. Um, but here they are. There is some distressing on them. And we are through the first box. Let me see how much time is left. Okay, so there's like 17 minutes. 
I think I'm going to um, open the next box on a different video. I don't want this to get too long. So, yeah, if you guys enjoyed this, which I'm guessing you didn't, um, but you should still like this video and subscribe to my channel, I would greatly appreciate that. Um, stay tuned. I'm going to open this next box. Um, hopefully I get some better brands. I don't know. We'll see. But I'll see you guys later.